Welcome to Versus Ask the Coach. It's a very, very sunny stage here at the Tour de France. And Max and Nat Tuckett asked, what, is the, what do the commentators mean when they talk about power or watts and how is it measured? Well, Max, it's measured either in the crank or in the rear wheel. Power tap as well as SRM make these power measuring devices that allow us to tell exactly how much torque these riders are putting into those pedals. That torque is converted into a watts number that they can read. Watts for a, a sprint could any, range from anywhere from 1,000 to 2,000 watts. Cavendish puts out right around 1,700, which is a huge number. Not the absolute highest because he's not a heavy guy at all. He's light and very aerodynamic. So he can make as much speed as the guy doing 2,000 watts with 1,700 watts because of other efficiencies. For longer range power, like Cancellar in the time trial, he averages over 400, probably closer to 500 for some of his time trials. That's a huge number. Most people his size, weight um, can do about 200 to 250 watts for an hour. So he's about twice as strong as the average cyclist. But ultimately, watts are a determination of how hard someone's working. It's a much it's a much more accurate way to determine how hard someone is going relative to speed, relative, relative to heart rate, relative to any other measurement because it's the actual power someone's putting into the pedals.